Hello everyone. There is not denying the Chinese engineering is one of the best in the world. The bridges, rail, highways, roads that the Chinese are constructing in Africa is out of this world. And not to mention the connectivity. This is going to have the airlines thinking. Chinese's pursuit of high-quality development and modernization has inspired many global South countries, including African nations, to take measures to boost development and alleviate poverty. African countries have gained confidence that they can achieve development and modernization. Their comrade, friend and partner, President Xi Jinping is a willing partner of Africa on its path to modernization and supports Africa to enhance its status on global stage. Please, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please kindly do so. A big thank you to all that have subscribed to the channel. I appreciate you. Let's go. Mozambique, China relationship is described as harmonious and based on equality and respect. Mozambican leaders have emphasized that relations with China have provided benefits and new opportunities that were not offered by the Western nations. The relationship includes economic and financial cooperation, trade, and foreign direct investment. At this point in time, let us call this relationship a mixed blessing. This is Maputo Katembe Bridge in Mozambique.
Any civil engineering student would have been overwhelmed and proud to work on such a breathtaking project. The Maputo Katembe Bridge is approximately 3,000 meters long, making it the longest suspension bridge in Africa. The Maputo Katembe Bridge stands approximately at 60 meters above Maputo Bay, allowing ships to pass underneath it. This is a significant infrastructure which is connecting the capital city, Maputo, on the north bank with the suburb of Katemba on the south bank. This connection has greatly improved transportation and accessibility in the region. This is the longest suspension bridge in Africa. It has reduced travel time between Maputo and Katembe, boosting trade, tourism, and economic activities. It also facilitates easier travel between Mozambique and South Africa, enhancing regional connectivity. The construction and funding was made possible by Chinese Exim Bank and constructed by the China Road and Bridge Corporation. During the construction of the Maputo Katembe Bridge, approximately 20,000 jobs were created, including both full time and part time positions. This significant employment boost provided many local residents with job opportunities and contributed to skill development in the region. For instance, Construction workers included laborers, masons, carpenters, and steel workers who were directly involved in building the bridge structure. Engineers and technicians, civil, structural, and mechanical engineer, along with technicians, played a crucial roles in the design, planning, and execution of the construction project. Project managers and supervisors. These professionals oversaw the construction process, ensuring that the project stayed on schedule and met quality standards. Heavy machinery operators. Yes. Operators of cranes, excavators, bulldozers, and other heavy machinery were essential for the various stages of construction. Safety officers. These safety officers are there to ensure that all staff on site are safe. Safety is implemented and monitored. The logistics and supply chain personnel. These workers managed the transportation and delivery of construction materials and equipment to the site. And many more such as administrative staff, clerks, accountants, and human resources personnel. The diverse roles not only contributed to the successful completion of the bridge, but also provided valuable employment and skill development opportunities for the local workforce. There is denying the construction of the bridge brought a lot of success. However, during the construction phase of the Maputo Katembe Bridge, the local community experienced some mixed emotions and reactions. Many residents were excited about the potential benefits the bridge would bring, such as improved connectivity, economic opportunities, and infrastructure development. The prospect of easier access to Maputo and the potential for increased business and tourism were seen as positive changes. However, there were also concerns about impact of construction on daily life. The daily noise, dust, and disruptions to the local traffic were common issues. Some residents were worried about the environmental impact and the potential for displacement due to the development. A significant number of, of people were affected by displacement as land was cleared for the bridge and associated infrastructure. While some were compensated and resettled, the process was not always smooth, leading to frustration and anxiety among those affected. All cons and pros considered, this is a great job well executed. Maputo Katembe Bridge is not just a success, but it is the pride of the country. It is the pride of Mozambique, thanks to the Chinese.